tonally, Morag sets up a lot of what is to come in the movie because we have this seemingly very serious dour situation that this guy who could be a human, could be a robot, we're not even sure what he is at first, finds himself in, and then very quickly we're, you know, attached back to Earth through the music playing. The contrast of the 1970s pop song playing while he's dancing through this very dark, evil-looking temple. Having the music on standby and understanding what's going to be playing is really helpful because it takes the pressure off. A movie like this is so much more than just acting. I mean, every set is a giant set. All the costumes of the aliens, of the extras, all of the music, the score, the visual effects, it's like this world is created. So when you hear the music and you get a sense of what's going to be playing at the time, you think, oh, the pressure's off. I can just be myself and be present in this moment, and, and it'll work. Okay. That's, That's good. Right up there. I think we got it, yeah.